So once again, Suncorp Stadium sees Melbourne Storm taking on the South City Rabbitohs. Not exactly a, a nice stadium for the Rabbitohs. I mean, considering the whole grand final stuff, they lost the grand final there is probably what I'm actually sort of referring to. But we're playing as Melbourne Storm. Veteran difficulty, seven and a half. Same lineups as what they're fielding in real life. Obviously, it's Magic Round. We're hopefully going to get a magical win with the Melbourne Storm. It makes sense. Like Magic and, you know, Thunder and that sort of stuff. It all sort of works with the Storm. Surely we get the dub. To Sun Corp Stadium, I've said it in literally all these Magic Round videos, but a packed out stadium, which makes perfect sense considering it is Magic Round. Kevin Murray leads out the mighty South Sydney Rabbitohs. Look like one of the few sides who can probably win the comp this year. It feels weird to be playing as a Melbourne Storm and be sitting here and being like, nah, I don't think they're a chance of winning the comp. It's just... It's just not Melbourne Storm-esque, especially with the team that we're taking on, which is the, the Rabbitohs. Usually it's these two sides sort of, you know, in amongst the grand final, not necessarily winning it or in the grand final, but definitely in the talks. And obviously in the previous like, couple of seasons, you probably would have said, oh yeah, the Storm, Rabbitohs might drop off. Instead, we're seeing we're seeing the Melbourne Storm being the ones that drop it off. Nick Mang on the screen right now, he's been pretty good. Was that Papanathan's out for a little while longer? And Nick Mang's going to get the game going too. So young Nicholas to get the game going. Come on, Storm. It's just, feel, again, like, there's just some of those sides that feel gross being like, go Manly, go Storm. Even if it's for a video, it just feels gross. Oh, high tackle. And just like a last minute spur of the moment decision to try and go for the big hit. I don't know why I do this. It, just, it never works anyways. Yes, there we go. That's what I wanted earlier. Warbrick comes up with a big hit, goes over the sideline. We get the ball back. Good stuff, Willie. I'm just going to try and run with Munster. Like, this this could just be a cheat code. No, it's not. Definitely not a cheat code. He gets driven back. Oh, I was looking. Oh, that's worked out all right. I was looking for Nick Meany there. We palm off Latrell. Harry Grant, pin the ears back, brother. Offload. I tried to do an offload. There's a guy right there. That would have been a terrible idea. Don't know if this is the play. Oh, Warbrick. He pummeled someone earlier. I can't pummel his way over the line. Trying. Oh, Olam. Fall over. Fall over. Oh, Olam. I thought we're over. We're going for the main. Grab it to Meanie. No, we're not. That. What are you supposed to do there? What am I supposed to do? You can't get a kick away. You can't do a crossfield kick. Can't put up a bomb. Couldn't even get a grubber off. Oh, there we go. That is karma. Warbrick is having an absolute blinder. He's belting Johnston. Oh, go, go. Oh, we're over. Ken Munster. That's what I thought was going to happen the first time. We just swerve our way through the defense there. Brilliant little play. I honestly didn't really know when the scrum was being, like, fed. I, I was like, there's nothing going on. What am I doing? I kind of didn't press any pass buttons. And then all of a sudden, Munster ran around just like he did. Look at him. Go. Like a gazelle. I think that was an old Rugby League 2 reference. So four about to become six. Cameron Munster. It's one of the easiest try you'll ever see. Tell you what, the little ankle tap had me a little bit worried, but once we got through that, it was try time. Oh, that's nice. Oh, I ran straight back at him. What am I doing? Big hit on Munster after he kicked it. That should be a penalty, mate. That should be a penalty. That should be a simming. Get him off. Oh, that's... Look, I read it, but I couldn't change. Well, I changed to the right player. It just dragged me infield for some reason. This is dangerous. It's going to hit the post, isn't it? It's going to hit the post. I can feel it. Yeah, it's hit the post. Come on. And I've run it dead. I've run it dead due to the change of camera. Oh, we charged it down. Oh, no. We charged it down. Oh, my God. They've actually, they've actually scored. They've actually scored. Why I went for the ankle tap there, I don't know. If I just went for a normal tackle, we probably could have... Scored there, but I don't understand why did it still not register as a tackle, even if it's not an ankle tap, just something. Also, oh, the charge down, the worst charge down of all time. So, Locker and Ilya, so no, he's not the normal goal kicker, but he is for today's video. So, Eagles it up 6 all. Feels kind of undeserved. So, South score a pretty filthy try. I will say ours is pretty filthy as well. So, look, it's a bit of a square out there. I thought that was forward. I'm not going to lie, that looked forward. Xavier Coates. Has there been a more disappointing signing? Oh, he's gone. Here it was. About to just shit on Xavier Coates. Makes a break. Gets a pass away too. Tarek Sims. If the offloads are half decent, it gets it to Hughes and we run the distance. Here it was. About to talk about Xavier Coates being a bit of a disappointing signing. And then all of a sudden does that run. That, oh, that's a hell of a pass. Tarek, fresh on the field. Palmed off Latrell and scores the try. That's the New South Wales origin player, Tarek Sims there. That's the man I remember. Rabbitohs be scoring dodgy tries from shitty charge downs. Meanwhile, I'm throwing some beautiful little passes there to Tarek Sims. We got a six point lead again. 
Nelson, drop him, drop him. Oh, no, 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 no. I didn't mean us get dropped. Did not mean us get dropped. Yes, we got the ball back. And eisenhoof has gone. I tried to do a pass out the rim of Smith too. That could have been risky, but would have been worth it. Harry Grant throws a little dummy and he's gone. Well, they have it. Half time it is. Would have been nice to have scored another try, but we've got a six point lead, so I am feeling quite comfortable. I feel like we're playing pretty decent as well. We're hitting the holes, we're throwing the passes, we're doing all the right stuff. Obviously, they scored for a pretty lucky try, but apart from that, it's been all us. Oh, no, you didn't expect that one. There we go. Oh, I went straight at him. Why do I do this? Why do I do it? Kamansa, big boot. Got the wind behind us, maybe? No, definitely not behind us, but we still get the kickoff. I thought it was going to be charged down. Oh, that's, that's terrible. That's a terrible kick. I thought it was good until I literally saw it just come into the frame. I was like, oh, what a great kick. 40-20, bam's out the pool. So look, not the best to start to the second half. As long as we defend well here, we should be all right, but just don't want to give the bunnies any chances. Oh no, get it. Oh, we read that. We read that. They executed it perfectly, but we read it. Tarek Sims, I don't know how he's driven back with Trell from that position, but I'll take it. Thank you, Rebel League Lava with your physics. Monster. Inside border monster takes on Latrell. The Latrell the dies. He's going to get run down. Just keep running, monster. Try your best, mate. Swerve. Come on, monster. We get to the line. The inside ball works a treat there. Ken, monster. They literally could have ankle tapped me at any point there. Just want to point that out. All the other times you get ankle tapped, for some reason they didn't do it. So we extend the lead, hopefully, by another six. There we go. The two points added is 18 to six. Karen Munster really ripping open this game. Well, double pump, double pump set to Katoa. Let's find Remus, Remus Smith. And they intercept it. Of course they freaking intercept it. Get him. Oh my god, we've read it again. They tried it again, you chick little buggers. But Charlie, you ain't scoring, mate. Mate, those try savers. I'm going to try and find Meanie here. Whoa, whoa, whoa. What is that run? He had a line that he was running, then he just changed. Oh, good run. Harry Grant gets out of trouble big time there. On the back foot to our south. Hopefully get a nice kickoff. Why are they... Okay, that's weird. Let's just kick it downfield. Find the grass, which we have. No, we haven't. No, we haven't. No, we haven't. Let's just get down there. Yes, good tackle, Munster. Go on. Go on. Coates. Can... Okay, Coates has been all right for us. Huge. Just the simple step. The simple step. Just look. We're just goosing. The goosey. Oh. No. How's the cutout pass? It's a cutout pass for a reason. Not pass it to the guy right next to you. How did they find the grass with that? Dead set. Dead set. Doesn't matter. We're going to score hit. No, we're not. We've been so dominant. Maybe South State. They could have used that 14th player this round, actually. One last try. One last chance. It's Cameron Monster time, baby. He's already scored a hat trick. Oh, why'd I step in field? Why'd I do that? Doesn't matter. We win by 12 points. One last chance to score. Thought Munster would have been written in the stars. Cameron Munster scores a hat trick. Wasn't meant to be. Uh, but look, an 18 to 6 victory. Fantastic win for us. Never in doubt.